pull that back. What do you mean by that? <laughs> Anyways, I was in love with him. <laughs> and he was in a relationship. <sighs> it was hard, it was hard. I mean, gosh. I was waiting for like, oh god, don't we hear it? How did break up? <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, which is Rosemary Brown here. Yeah, and if you're just watching my video for the first time, thank you so much for stopping by to watch this video. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, all that good stuff, you know. So today's video is going to be about we're just going to be discussing like majorly Hello. discussing. Hello. So we're not going to be just she like, hasn't introduced me. Anna, <laughs> don't forget. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Rosemary Bohan here. And if you're just watching my video for the first time, thank you so much for stopping by to watch this video. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, all that good stuff. So today I have a special guest with me. And she's already familiar with some of you guys. If you've watched my last video, if, if you've not watched that video, I'll link it somewhere up oh, below people. so you can watch. <laughs> I know I'm not consistent. Oh. So, if you've not watched that video, I'm going to link it somewhere wow. on the screen so you can watch it wow. so you get familiar with this wow. beautiful wow. face that I'm about to show you. So, this is my friend, Tare Ugu. And for the first time, mm -hmm. we are live. Um, okay, wait. Right. <laughs> Last time I told you that I'm opening my beauty lounge, and for the first time, we are live in. TME Beauty. So you are currently filming this video in our beauty store, TME Beauty Lounge. So if you stay on the island, like his joke at your axis, please turn up, um, turn up from your girl. Come through, come and fix your nails, <laughs> like mine. Come for your pedicure, come for your <laughs> lashes, your microblading, and all that beautiful stuff yeah, that girls just like really to look fly. So yeah, TME Beauty Store is the place to be. Yeah. So today's topic is going to be about we're just going to be giving our two cents on what we think about your partner having the opposite sex as a bestie. <laughs> so I'll just be saying what I feel, I should also be saying what she feels about yeah. it. Um please leave in the comment section what you also feel. If you disagree with us or not, we'd like to know your take on this discussion. What do you think about your partner having the opposite sex as the best friend so if this looks like a discussion you like to be involved in or you like to hear your opinion on this video please keep on watching this video so tare you're going first this time around so what do you think about like your partner having the opposite sex like having a female bestie like what's your take generally on that one mm. <laughs> dramatic much so tell us, mm. we like to know, like, what do you think about? Well, let me see the truth. <laughs> Please tell us. I've Please. been a best friend. Mm -hmm. I've been a best friend, mm -hmm. so I will not like for my boyfriend to have a best friend of the opposite gender. I'm because sorry. You're not. I'm sorry. So but why, why, why? Because okay, let me just say me. Oh god, I'm using myself for this example. Okay, fine. My best friend in a long time ago is not my best friend. Mm -hmm. you, you fumbled that bag. What do you mean by that? <laughs> Anyways, I was in love with him. <laughs> and he was in a relationship. <sighs> it was hard, it was hard. I mean, gosh. I was waiting for like, oh god, don't we hear <laughs> How did you break up? <laughs> no, no, I'm sorry. You're lying, I said the truth. You're waiting for what? Okay, fine, yes. And I'm sure I like, would have been coming to report to you and say, yeah, they're ready. Yeah, like, and your mind is like, misbehaving. I'm like, ah, don't mind them, just leave them alone. Because uh, I want you. <laughs> you hear that? I'm not proud. <sighs> And even though he never made my wish come true, I just had to move on because I was in love. So we we, we became acquaintances. So, so don't that's have... why you guys are only friends anyway. Yes. Because you 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 fell in love. Yes. Like you started catching feelings on yes. the way. I'm so shameless. I even told him I was in love. You even told him? Yes. 
And it was in a relationship, yes. Guys, can you hear that? Tare. Tare's ex, if you're watching this video. Who is the ex? <laughs> Tare's best friend that ex she best ex friend. Ex best friend that she fell in love with and hmm. that was the reason why the relationship or the best friendship came and to an end. Yeah. You didn't try at all. Uh -huh. you try. Are you but you tried me? though. I'm blaming her because she's not understanding catching feelings. She, you you know how to catch feelings. So my this is that like I've, it has never happened to me personally, but I've heard of situations where it has happened to them personally, whereby the boy, like maybe after breaking up with his girlfriend, then immediately they start dating that so-called bestie. And meanwhile, that bestie might even be part of the issue they had in their relationship. Mm -hmm. Let me say, the girl was always telling him that, mm -hmm. ah, you, need to, you and your friend, you are too close. And he'll be telling her that, ah, we're just friends, yeah. we're just friends. There's nothing, that. There's nothing to worry about. She's my best friend. And this, this, that, that. And then when you have break up, then, yeah, ah, that's that to me. That didn't happen to me. <laughs> Yo. Not everybody's story ends that way. Like, mm. except both of them start catching feelings. Like, well, mm. your own was just well, one sided. It depends. Your own was just one sided. If it's. I don't know. I don't know. Don't do that. Don't fall into that don't trap. Don't do that, guys. Don't fall into that trap. Mm. Stop. But there are some people. Unless they. Don't do that. The, the best friend is gay. I don't know. <laughs> No, 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 but actually, guys, please leave it, leave it in the comment section. Like, do you have the opposite sex as your best friend? If you have a guy, do you have a girl as your best friend? And if you have a girl, do you have a boy as a best friend? I've heard that some people's friendship are like they're just really close, they're friends. Yeah, no, there's some people nothing, like that. Nothing at all, no string at all, but they just really care about yeah, each the other. exception to the rule. Like brothers and sisters. But I don't think I believe in that though. I feel that the only reason why I'll be okay with my partner having a female best friend is a situation whereby that female best friend also has a boyfriend. Yes, like both of them oh, are in a relationship. Okay. Okay. Because yeah. most of the time, if like, let me say, it is one-sided mm. and the male best friend has a girlfriend, let me mm. say, which is me, mm. like I'm his girlfriend, his female best friend does not have a boyfriend. Mm. Everything that is happening in our relationship, you guys start reporting, start there, anything. Just know that that female best friend knows everything about you. Just, just know that. Just know that Very everything. True. Even your best call of self, the female best friend will know because when they are just well, the ones buying the gifts. Yes, because they are best friends actually. When they are just in now, you start just choosing them. your birthday gifts. Exactly. So they start just now by your friend and everything and all that. So Sad. guys, please leave in the comment section. Do you agree with us? My take on this is that no, I don't agree. No, no, not I do not agree. On the exception that the female best friend also has a boyfriend. Okay, so that's what you agree with. Yes, she okay. has a a boyfriend so that you not be always needy the, mm. the name of i don't even get what i'm saying yeah. i don't even guys get what i'm saying like like it's usually safer that way like it's better don't you don't you agree don't you agree eh? so that the female best friend not be like our sister yet that right? <laughs> that's yes oh now we got an example we got to anybody that will start catching things for the boy then you now start hoping that oh we didn't know and I feel that it's better that they just make it clear with each other that, like, if you have feelings, just tell the person that you have feelings. I guess. I, I, I never had feelings from the beginning. It was so ill. Just like, green. Yeah, yeah, they became oh. so close. But later, like, oh, I actually love this boy. <laughs> but he didn't have the same feelings. So. They have the same feelings. That's the thing. But I never said that. I never said that like that. We're always friends. Right. See, that's the thing. They always no friends. attraction. Every relationship always starts with what? Friendship. friendship. <laughs> exactly. So me, I feel I don't think I like this best. I feel like your partner should be your best friend. Who agrees with me? If you agree with me, please just leave it in the comment section below. Don't don't you don't agree with me. I don't. I'm sorry. Are you serious? Because yes. the reason I say that is because your best friend basically like knows everything about you. You guys talk about everything. Yeah. So your partner too, like it's the same thing. Like you don't keep secret. Okay, I mean or for the opposite gender, yes, but not my best friend, best friend. I mean we need some space sometimes. I'm sorry. Yeah, okay. That's another I don't know, thing. I don't know, but okay, I know. What am I saying? I don't know. I feel I don't think I want my partner to be my best friend. Was explaining. I've been talking a lot. Okay, fine. Explain. You mean like, okay, it's nice. So some people it works out, but I don't think I want that because so, friendships are more personally friendships are more important to me than relationships. 
On that note, yes, so yes, I agree with you on that friendship so, are more important because when I was dating, my partner was like my best friend, everything I didn't even have time for most of my friends. Yeah. When we broke up like this, no mm. and that's when I, I didn't know, I didn't even realize that okay. you will not realize that, yes, like, yes. okay, this person because you always spending time with this person, yeah. everything this person, you will never realize that other of your friends were yeah, yeah, yeah. when we broke Lacking up, in that relationship. when we broke up. Let's say it ended in tears, not tears like a relationship did not end badly, but I realized that most of my friends like weren't close to you. Yes, yeah. wearing clothes because I didn't That's have time for them. Yes. I wasn't spending time with them. Yeah, I, I was just focused on She never had time for us. God ah. <laughs> So yeah, so that's my take on it. Like so I feel friendship is very important. I agree with you on that. I five. Yeah, so my partner is not my best friend. Sorry, guys, what's your take on that? Should your partner be your best friend? Please, we like to hear your take on this. Please comment on this conversation. Be your, be, should your partner be your best friend or no? You don't want a partner. My own take on this is that I feel like your partner should be your. Now, yeah, interested. I think I'm rethinking that. Like, <laughs> I think yes, you should be very close with your partner. Yeah, but you yes, close. but don't no. neglect your other friends. That's it. I'm don't not. be that kind of friend that when you yeah, get into a relationship, relationship, you forget your yeah. other friends. It's no, just no. me and my boo, me and my yeah. my guy, or me and my babe. Another. I think because when it ends, you're gonna be alone. <laughs> take it for me. Take it for me. Like <laughs> that happened to me. You need before. friends. Yeah, you need friends in this life. So like good. that your partners can be your best friend, but do not neglect your other friends. Like have other friends. Cause to end it yes, like <laughs> take it for me. I think is that I do not depend on your partner so much yes you can be friends you enjoy your company but have friends outside of that relationship yeah because i don't know it builds i feel it will build resentment along the way because you are too dependent on each other you draw so by in case it ends what's going to happen yeah so yeah i think so, we're, we're on the same page on that like take it from me guys <laughs> Take it from me. Don't just be you. Yeah, don't be that kind of friend. I have other friends. Cause when they, uh, so far they are not married. So guys, thank you so much for watching to the end. If you watched it to this end, if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like. Don't forget to subscribe. Another good stuff. Till next time, guys. Bye.